a little more gentle. Here, let me show you. Put your hand under and you give the leaf a little support. Now you try it. Perfect. You got it. Sorry again about this happening at such a late hour. But I just get so distracted during the day with orders and customers. It's not a problem. Yeah, I like to give my attention, my full attention when I do this. I think people these days, young people especially, don't really give their full attention to anything. Uh, yeah, I agree. You have a beautiful shot, by the way. Oh. Thank you so much. I think the reason that I've been able to keep this shop open as long as I have is because I do things differently. You know, I've never had children. I've never regretted it either. I think the reason is because these are my children. Devin? Mrs. Devin? Uh, yes. Um, where do you want me to put the box? Right here is fine, dear. Thank you. <laughs> Beth, do you smell that? Uh, Breathe in. No, what should I be? Pure air. <sighs> Uncontaminated. Do you know why? No. It's because of these beauties. The leaves, they oxidize. They remove the poisons from all around us. The formaldehyde, benzene. Clean it all up. You see, Beth, when you love and nurture something, it will love and nurture you in return. There's one more thing I'd like to show you before you go. Okay. What I'm about to show you is not something I show everyone. You can even call it a secret, in fact. You can keep a secret, right? Yeah, sure. Wait here. Isn't she beautiful? really sure of her origins. She was passed down to my mother from her mother before her. I just call her Julia. Beth, um, do you know why I'm showing you Julia? No. It's because if you work here, part of your duties will include taking care of her. How would you feel about that? Yeah, sure. The thing about Julia is that 
She requires special care. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. Is, is that alive? All plants are alive. Here now, your turn. What? What's needed to be done? What, cut my hand? I'm not cutting my hand. But you must. It's why you're here. Miss Devon, please put the knife down. Think of it as an honor to be able to care for Julia. Stop. Stop, you're scaring me. Beth, if you're unwilling to do it this way, I'll have other methods. Thank you for coming out tonight, dear. I know this can be an odd hour and all. But I wanted to give you my full attention when I do this. It's not a problem. 